Hello, welcome to Akita Railroad Train for Joseph and Structural Engineers. My name is Fashe Ochet. Today, we want to see how we can, you know, generate our reports for our connections. You know that when it comes to um, concrete, when it comes to concrete, you know that we have uh, said it, that by the time you finish your design and everything, and also ready for printing, your printing will go alongside with your design report because the people at the Ministry of uh, Work, they will not, they are not in your system. So is that your report that they will see to say that yes, to approve your drawing before you can start execution. So therefore, you know that in this concrete, for us to look for it, for instance, let me come to concrete design and let me go for beam and let's see example of this. So you know that in this place, okay, let's say I've removed all of the, I've removed the mark, all the marks, I've removed them. So let me use this one as an example. I want to generate report for this. So I'll click on what on report because this is what they will see in the Ministry of Work that they will now approve your, your drawing because without it, Ministry of Work will not know either the structure is safe or not but with the help of your drawing, so design report, they will do what? They will go through it and say that yes, it is safe so as you can see this one, we discover that yes, this structure, this particular beam is what? is safe because if you look at it, deflection check is what? is okay and you can see the choice of what? of our reinforcement, 2Y13 top and also 2Y16 bottom so that is that i can see our diagram the shear force diagram and many moments the diagram so you can see everything here so what do i do i close it so having done this this is for steel you see when you are designing concrete you discover that you go alongside with your design report for this for your concrete but what now happen when it comes to steel design what now happen when it comes to steel design so you discover that there's a need for you sorry there's a need for you to do what there's a need for you to also generate your what your drawing I don't know if you are with me it's very very important to also generate your connections is that okay so this is your connection that we are talking about now how do you now do for that of a um and what do you call it um steel like this connection here you know that this one have been designed is safe isn't it very good but how do you now generate this connection here and from this to also detect this one that yes this particular one is safe and also show you what the size is and don't forget that before now go to our equity channel in case you have not subscribed to equity channel at this point i want to say you should subscribe at the same time time like our videos sorry like our videos because by doing that you make our video to go viral at the same time you are also benefit making others to benefit because youtube will be doing what sending more of our videos to those who are in need of the knowledge that you are also getting now so Doing that invariably, you are also helping with others. So click on like button and also su subscribe. And not only that, on your own part, you can also tell people about what about Ecredem, where we make structural design so simple and also um, safe because we want to see how we can avoid all this collapse in Africa. So that is that. Now coming to this place again, I said we have done video on how to check if your this particular structure is safe. As you can see, this one here, that yes, this structure is what is safe. Let me close it. Let me close this. Let me close this so you can see. Now, checking my design status, you discover that this structure is what? Is safe. Perfectly what? Okay. There's no problem. This structure is safe. Now, likewise, we have also checked for our steel member to see that our connection to see if they are safe. And we say, how do you do that? We click on what? On your design summary. So once you click on it, let's wait for it and see to first of all see if our connection are what? Are safe. So as you can see here, they all pass. This is now. They all pass 0 0.092 less than what less than one 0 0.096 less than one so etc so you can see all our connection here are what are very very okay so at this junction having known that the connection are what are safe and you can see the size of what of our members and also connection are what are all safe so what we would need to do is that how do you not tell people at the ministry of work that this structure so these are connection are what are perfectly okay so how do you inform them how do how would they know that yes what you have designed is what is very very okay just like in your concrete you always print your design report so it's also expected of you to also show them your design report for steel especially for your connections because very very important those connections are very important have we check how our structure is being say is safe so it's also need, very important to also show that our connect the design report of our connections is that okay so now we have talked about how to edit this now how will you identify the one that is safe or the one that 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 feels let me quickly show you that though we have done video on that you can also go and watch that particular video but let me just show you briefly on one let me click on design report and let's wait let's wait for it so it has come 
So now, at this junction, how will I know the member that is what? That is safe among these. So if I click on the first one now, I'll double click. So you can see it now. So it's telling me that this one is what? It's one that is safe. So you can see it's designed and what is safe. Then the next one is what? Let me click on the next one. So you can see it's telling me that what is safe. The third one is also telling me that what is safe. You can see my connection. My connection here is what is safe, which means perfectly what? Perfectly okay. So I can close this one. So that's how to check. In case anyone fail, the same way you could double click on it. So it will take you to the particular one that was that is a uh, um that is what that is failing. So that is that. So at this junction, I want to follow me with all this I have said. I want to say that let's go there and see how we can now um de generate our design report. Is that okay? Just as we have generated for that of a concrete, let's also generate for um what do we call it? Let's also generate for our connections. Is that okay? So that is that. And how to reduce this? That have been what have been done. And finally, I want to say that when it comes to Ecredel, we have Ecredel group whereby we have other engineers. Where, for example, yes, I'm designing this particular structure, and I'm facing a particular challenge. What happened? I can post it there, and before you know it, all other engineers that are in that group will fully respond to help me solve the problem. So at this point, let's now see. So all I need to do now, for example, let me start with this one. Let me click on this because I want to generate a report for this particular set plate, this particular connection. Once you have clicked on it, you have to click on it first. Is that okay? You click on it first. Then the next thing you do is to come here and click on either create or you click what show report. Is that okay? So I click on what on create while I wait for it. So it's now trying to generate the design report just now. So it's trying to generate our design report. So let's wait for it. It's coming up. Let's wait for it. It's coming up. So it's very, very important. To generate this because this is what they are going to take to the ministry of work and this is what they are going to go through before they can approve what your drawing for your what for your execution so let's wait for it it's coming up so it's coming up okay it's coming up let us wait you see it's opening so let's wait for it it's coming up so it's coming up so you can see now it has generated our what our report can you see the calculation sheet so do you see it now can we see it so you can see you can see it has generated automatically so it's showing us what pass and at the ministry of work they are going to say that everything pass and all the dimension you can see you can see it here you can see can you see it now you can see everything do you see the 90 by 90 our, our diagonal you can see it even our set plate you can see now our um that the one that this one that's connected to what to our uh boosted, um diagonal you can see it now you can see the size so i've been shown so that is that and let's now go back and see how we can generate for the other aspect is that okay for this one now we have gotten this one then how do i generate for this one also this one i can use this one if they are the same thing if this connection that this type of connection is what i use all through for this type then i will only need what one we stand for all and for example i'll use this one if it's the same thing also used for us all this type of a connection so now since i've got generated this one i need to generate this one also i'll click on it come to what come to create and let's wait for it and see what it's going to give us is that okay so let's wait for it. You can see it has come up. You can see our stanchion. Our st um, stanchion. Do you see now? You can see our stanchion, which is the column. So you can see the size of column that we are having. You can see it here, and you can see the beam. The size of the beam. Do you see it now? So you can see the connection here. This connection now. You can see the calculation. So you can see web welded. You can see the number and all of that. You can see the calculation. So you can see the calculations. You can see it. You can see. You can see everything. What is saying? Yes, yes, and also pass, pass. Is that okay? So do you see it now? Do you see it now? So everything has been calculated. So these are our words. This is how to generate your steel design report. This is our connection report. This is how to generate it. So thank you very much. In case you have not subscribed, I want to say again, try and subscribe to Epidel. We are with train civil future and structure words engineers. So thank you very much. Till I see you in the next video. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe. Thank you. God bless you.